Hey YouTube, this is Ivy and today I'm coming over here to give you guys a really quick initial review. I have in um, a new hair. This hair is from Lola's Hair Company. This is the Malaysian Wavy. I have in four bundles of 28 and a closure. Now, my hair was really long initially, but I did cut it off because I didn't like how it looked flipped over and really long. When I wear my hair flipped over, it looks better more at about a 24 inch and for my closure i have a i believe a 16 inch closure also in malaysian natural wavy and i actually made a u part and the part that you leave out for your leave out i actually just sold the uh closure right there so i i sold the closure down and then i sold on the u part so that is the way i would do a flip over you know with a, a U part instead of trying to do the flip over method on the cap it's just easier like that to me um you still get the same great look uh so it really doesn't matter it's like preference and you know how fast or long you want to take to get done this is the this is a quick way to do it okay uh, the first thing I noticed when I got this hair was that the wefting on this hair was a lot thicker than my other hair that I had. And I also noticed that this hair is a lot more silkier. So if you're um, looking for like a silky type of texture that's really lightweight, the Malaysian hair is for you. This hair has a nice loose wave pattern. I decided to show the initial review with the hair in its natural state. All I did was uh, co-wash the hair. The product I like to use on the hair is the Crema Nature with Argan Oil from Morocco Strength and Shine Leave-In Conditioner. Looks like this. I'm sure you guys have seen this in Target, Walgreens, you know, all those type of stores. And I like to shake this up and spray this on the hair like in the morning and scrunch it up. It just makes the hair really soft and it smells awesome and it holds um, the curl. It acts as a um, like a curl activator and it keeps the hair you know wavy and curly pretty long. The closure is a tad bit wavier than the hair. It might be to it might be due to the fact of it being shorter but for the most part the curl pattern is pretty much consistent. I really love this curl pattern. One because it's easy to take care of because it's really cold here in Chicago and I can just spray it, scrunch it, and it's dry in like five minutes. It's so low maintenance. I love that. I haven't been receiving a whole lot of shedding and tangling and I like that. I like hair that I can just, you know, carefree, scrunch it, and go. At night, I usually will put my hair in a low ponytail and put on a scarf. And on my edges, as you guys know, I use Jamaican black castor oil every single night. You guys ask me all the time, well, how do you get your hair so straight? You guys, I just put on the castor oil every night and I flat iron my hair, you know, whenever it starts waving up or looking frizzy. And I guess the castor oil keeps it from getting heat damage. Um... But for the most part, with the flat iron, my hair just gets like super silky straight and it has a high gloss to it. So that's pretty much all I do. It's no secret. Um, I saw you guys what you were saying in my last video, but it's I'm telling you guys, it's no secret. And if you guys didn't know, I do dye my extensions black. I like to use the Revlon Color Silk in soft black. And it just gives me this really nice, soft not jet jet black but it's it's black um type of color because my natural hair is jet black and that's pretty much it you guys i hope you enjoyed this initial review stay tuned for the full review and talk to everybody soon